Greetings, minions, Romulans, and fellow gamers. This is Silverblade Dagger playing Imperion Galactic Survival, and this is episode 13. Uh, as you've seen in my previous episodes, and I hope you've seen my previous episodes, I've been working on this ship challenge that uh, my buddy Hell Admir had put forth. Basically, uh, the idea is to create a all-in-one ship. Uh, basically a base ship that uh, you can fly everywhere, do everything you need, process stuff, and survive fights. And off camera I finished off this wing. Uh, it took a little longer than I was hoping. Still taking a lot longer than I was hoping. It should have been done in one episode. It's taken, well, three. And we haven't even got the engines on it yet. So we're going to have to correct that. And uh, one of the things they did in the new update that happened just a few days ago, at least a few days ago for me, is they changed around the RCS. So it looks a little different than it used to. And uh, let's see, where is it? Right here, it looks like a coffee maker or a miniature tokamak reactor. And if you don't know what a tokamak reactor is, well, think of that big giant reactor that was in Iron Man 1 uh, that was kind of in the background um, when Jebediah Stane was talking to the one engineer. It's got that big toroid donut-shaped ring with the energy plasma burning off in it. That's a tokamak reactor, essentially. And this is like a miniature one. And it's different than the one that he used to have in this game. They look more like Mr. Fusion from Back to the Future. Which, you know, it kind of disappoints me <laughs> that they changed that. Um, I like the changes. I just wish that they made it so you can keep with the original style. You know what I mean? So anyways, let's get cracking. And I think the last stage for this build is get an engine on. So I'm thinking... Go like this. And we can build everything else down here. There we go. So for the tail end, and I had to extend out my landing platform. Because you know why. <laughs> Reasons. <laughs> um, yeah, so what we're going to do is we're going to get rid of all the blocks that are in our inventory. Um, well, put them in in the inventory from our toolbar here and we're going to grab thrusters the uh, maneuvering thrusters the generator and the RCS and for now that should be about it so the thruster is going to stand off on the back end if I can rotate it just right there we go that's all nice and pretty. So we're going to put in a reaction thruster. Uh, let's see, how are we going to do this? Uh, okay, we're going to have to put in the generator. And we'll put that right there. We'll just flip it around. So it looks like it's part of the engine. And then we'll put the RCS like that. Looks almost like a rocket as it is, doesn't it? And we're in the water. <laughs> Come on! <laughs> That's just part of the game. Alright, so we got this part done. Now for uh let's get back up. Just a little just a little uh that was a love tap, it wasn't that big of a jump. Come on. And here we go again. So I really wish that it was finer controls for movement, but we'll just deal with it. And so we got the engine in the back. We might have to adjust that later. 
So what I want to do now is put on reaction thrusters. If it'll switch. And we're going to set that... And we'll set it up towards the front. So what we're going to do is we're going to put in... Um, take these out and put this in. Oop, get up there. There we go. So this is going to be a spacer. Alright, so reaction control thrusters. We will put one here. Uh, wrong thruster. <laughs> Come on, scroll down. There we go. So we'll put... Alright, gotta rotate it around just right. There we go. So one's going there. And see if we can rotate this around just right. Make sure you're not screwing it up. One like that. One down. Or not. <laughs> this way let's see it rotated there and we will need the jump jet to get back up I call them jump jets partly because I've played the mech warrior games so much and then the name just kind of sticks <laughs> alright so let's get this rotated right So that should do it there. There. So now we have some steering. Now I'm going to get some rounded blocks. And uh, kind of smooth this out. So in order to do that, we need to make some. So let's go get some shape isn't exactly as I intended and I can buff it out later but I want to get it flying enough so I can get on the underside so I want we'll make 20 of these and 20 of these hopefully that's enough fingers crossed lots of luck hopeful <laughs> so it'll take just a second and I think I will have to move some of those blocks a little bit now that I'm imagining how it's going to look hopefully it'll protect the engines to a degree and look good so let's see what else first of all let's just go to the hand talk to the hand there we go because I don't like seeing that block in front of my face. And I'm pretty sure that you guys don't want to see that either. And we'll move these over. And as soon as these are done, we'll go back and uh, get that engine pylon going. And then we'll see if we can get the ship to actually fly enough so that we can work on the rest of it. Now I'm thinking I'm going to have to do some modifications to my hangar area. Uh, put in ladders and all that so that I can actually climb to get to the spaces I need to without using the stupid backpack or jetpack. You guys know my struggle with that. Alright, so we'll put uh, these and these in the hot bar. So, let's see, how are we going to do this? Alright, switch it over. There we go. Yeah. 
rotate. Alright, so now we'll get these pieces. Once it rotates in there. And we can put that one right there. Okay, well I guess that will go up here. Oops, I think it went a little too far on that. There we go. Excuse me. Alright. Looking good, looking good. There we are. Boom! There we go. So it's a recessed reverse, which really it would have been better if it was right there. It would look better anyway. We got engines out there. We can see the engine guts, which will be protected. You never fear that. I'm gonna extend the engine housings, or you know, the coverings. Or shrouds, whatever you want to call them, out to here. Much like I did on Star Fury. But for now, uh, we gotta get inside this, don't we? Uh, and I got 2% power, which isn't enough to get it to fly. So we have to get inside. I need to move the ship forward at the very least. So let's go for a swim, huh? Yeah, you're drowning. You deserve it. You can't jump straight worth a damn, so suck it. And you're gonna suck it again, aren't you? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, come on. Stop being a wussy. There we go. That was actually a pretty good jump. Alright, so let's get this sucker powered up. That's one fuel cell. And that's the second. Third and fourth. And man, this thing is going to be sucking power like crazy all right not too shabby guys not too shabby let's uh, close the tailgate door here if I can doesn't want to do it does it uh I think I just killed the base. <laughs> okay. Oh, hello. Yeah, the base just went nuts. So let's give it a look. Look, see, huh? Ooh, it's mad sexy. Let's go up a little. We got enough thrust to do that. Uh, we can go forward a little bit. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> yeah, those reaction thrusters aren't enough to move the bulk weight of this thing. And I can't steer it. <laughs> that is sad. <laughs> that is just sad. <laughs> Alright, let's kill it. <laughs> And get out. Alright, well, that was a worthy shot. 
and we're going to be suffering for frame rates just because reasons. Let's try and get engines on this side. So let's see how do we do it over here. Okay, that shouldn't be too hard to follow back. I have to make another row of blocks on top. Uh, okay. So we'll get in the inventory. Strip these out for now. Put these back in. Align these the way we want them. Draw them out. Excellent. So now we need to get these back in. And what else was there? I think that was it. Alright, so let's drop down. Get this engine on it. Now to make sure we get the uh, the looks of the generator right, let's make sure it's rotated the right way. I don't think there's a wrong way, but I could be wrong. Okay, so that's that's the right way. And plop. RCS, plop, and then if I recall right, I put in a spacer. I'm going to actually put in two spacers. Alright, and this is where the reverse thrust will go. just nicely there there and there sweet Oh yeah, you want to be all pussyfooting now, but when I need you to get a little oomph in it, you overdo it. What the hell? Come on, game, work with me. <laughs> Alright, so, flip that up. Can't see if it's on right or not, and it's not. And there we go. So we'll snap that into place. Boop, ready to go. We do have to put the the, uh, the cover on it, of course, but uh, doing pretty good now, don't you think? Soon we'll be flying this bad boy. So we'll do the initial covering on it. And that one goes up top. That one goes there. That one. Let's see. Rotate. It goes there. And there. This one specifically goes there. Let's see. And that one goes. Come on. Don't be shy. There we go. 
Awesome. There, so we got the initial cowlings on it. Still got to get the rest of that covered. things are going good it goes damn good when things are going bad it goes really bad so far things are going all right I wouldn't say ideal but all right there we go so we got two sets of engines on let's see how maneuverable this is Excuse me again, yeesh. Okay, I'm hitting the thrusters and it's not wanting to climb. And yeah, I can't get it to can't get it to climb at all. Heck, I could barely get it to nose up. Alright, I can rotate it, that's nice. So it is a little more maneuverable now. Not by much, but it is uh, able to be moved. And I'm probably crunching up all sorts of parts on this bad boy. Oh, come on. Maybe I can just get it off the edge just enough. Or hopefully not too much. And that's it. Get out. Alright, so let's see how are we doing here. Alright, we're hanging off just enough to get the underside done. That's a good thing. Now I'm thinking I'm going to have to put in some thrusters for lift. Oops, they want the helmet on. So basically we're just going to keep repeating this pattern. I'll probably finish this off camera. You know, I mean, you, you've seen what I've done so far. You know, where I'm going with it. And I'm just going to, you know, continue repeating it. You know, what, I'm, what I've gotten done so far. Um, shouldn't take much. Oh, come on. Get that thing to work. Is that right? Looks right. Yep. All right. So essentially we're just going to repeat everything we did above on both wing pylons. So engine Ah, uh, yep, that was the right spot. Just got to rotate around. Put in the uh, generator. RCS. And I got to put in the spacers. So what we'll do is we'll do this. Put in the block. And that. So 
It's going good, guys. Going good. We're almost almost done with this ship, even on camera, which is actually impressing me to some degree. All right, so that goes there. And it goes there. And let's see what... That goes there. Just rotate it around. Okay, come on. Work with me here, buddy. Come on, pal. There we go. So we'll rotate that. Let's see. There we are. And pop you right there. Not too shabby, guys. Not too shabby. So, let's get inside. And power her up. Oh, it's not nose down. Mm, come on. You can do it, girl. You can do it. Work it like Daddy taught you. That's right. It's all nasty like that. Naughty. And get like er, er, er. oh. All right. Now we are in the water again. <laughs> Space apparently is not a dry place. Come on, you're not drowning. You're just not breathing right. Get you a breathe right nasal strip or something. Not a sponsor. <laughs> I don't know if those things even exist anymore. I haven't seen them on anybody or on the news and commercials. Any of that mess. Get your bat ass back there. There we go. All right, we need a main engine. The last engine, guys. I'm so jazzed. All right, controller or a uh, controller uh, generator. RCS. Get. There you go. Good RCS. Good. Silverblade pleased. <laughs> Alright, so we need a spacer. Actually, I think we need two spacers. If I have my figures right. Take this around just right. Can't even see that. Okay, that's a forward one. Get on there. Okay, and this one, rotate it that way. go. Oh, 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 where the heck? <laughs> oh, man. How'd we get underneath here? Ugh. Now, I'm telling you that by the next episode, we should be in space. I want to end this week. 
in space on another planet would be nice. All right, so let's rotate this around. All right, this one we gotta flip up. There we go. And there we are, guys. Got it all on. I think the only thing we really have to, to nerf on this is the one engine over there. Uh, we need to remove it. Or, you know, it's a thruster. We need to remove that, put a block in, and then put the thruster out more. Uh, off camera, I'm going to do the rest of this. But we are almost done with this thing. I gotta get oxygen in it. Uh, let's see, what other gear do I gotta put in? I gotta put cargo holds, fridges, lights, landing gear, uh, something spiffy on the roof, kinda break up the flatness of it. Let's give, let's give it a fly th test, shall we? It's probably it flies like a brick. Oh, hey. Oh my, this is actually not too shabby. And it shoots too. <laughs> it's getting a little unwieldy now. Yep. I need to get some downward thrusters on this. But it's working. It's working. A uh, trick to keeping it from falling is keeping it level. And you have to do the, the roll and pitch just right. Just to keep it sane. But it's got some pretty good maneuverability. It does get a little unwieldy, but it's working. And for me, that is something for the wing column in a great way. <coughs> wow, excuse me. A great way to end this episode. Me coughing up a lung. So anyways, guys, I, I really hope you like this. I'm actually quite pleased. Got it to work. It's not absolutely horrible. It was a bit of a chore to get working right, but we got it going. That's got to count to something, right? Raise it up a little bit. Flatten her out. Not that much. Alright, so guys, if you like this episode, please click the like button. If you didn't, well, you didn't. <laughs> But uh, at least uh, leave me a comment. Tell me what what I did wrong. What you'd like to see. Uh, yeah, something I could could have done better. Um, wow. Uh, but yeah, you know, give me some input so I know what I'm doing right, what I'm doing wrong, what you would like to see, what you would not like to see. Um, that kind of stuff. If you are bored, well. You're not watching this, so, you know, to hell with you. Uh, just kidding. Uh, those even... Those better be. I think so, yeah. But, uh, yeah. I hope you're enjoying this. I'm having a blast. Come on, get on there. I just want to wrap this episode up with that and my wind column. <laughs> Should have done this off camera, but Hold on. yeah. Uh, if you think my videos are worth sharing, by all means, please. By all means, <laughs> please do. Uh, if you think that my videos can help somebody with their game, 
Uh, yeah, it, and it's also free advertising, which I would definitely appreciate. And that looks off. It definitely looks off, but I could be seeing things. But anyways, yeah, uh, please share my videos if you feel they're worthy. If not, well then don't. Um, what else? Oh yes, please subscribe so you can keep up to date with all my videos as I make them. And I got my landing gear on backwards. <laughs> oh, come on, come on, up, 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 up. No. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, please subscribe so you can keep up to date with all my episodes. I'll be changing up my schedule in, probably this next week. So you want to keep up to date with that. Let me set this bad boy down before I hurt myself. Alright. Good to go. So anyways, I know this episode's run a little long, but hey, we got it done. And I'm actually kind of happy about it. I mean, it's not too terribly bad. I got some tweaking to do, obviously, but it's working. And that's bonus. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching uh, and putting up with me. I really do appreciate it. And until next time, seizure later. Twitch. Twitch.